Strictly Come Dancing judge Shirley Ballas has revealed she would love to be a contestant on IMA Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. However, the star unveiled the reason she cannot take part in the ITV series, Strictly Come Dancing's Shirley Ballas appeared alongside television presenter Christopher Biggins for the ITV documentary series The Savoy on Wednesday evening. The program showed the pair dining in the opulent London Hotel, but Shirley shocked Christopher when she revealed she would jump at the chance to be on I Am a Celebrity. Get me out of here. However, she had to explain career commitments are stopping her from appearing in the reality series. The ballroom star has been a judge on Strictly Come Dancing since 2017 when she replaced head judge Lynn Goodman. Shirley is set to return to the judging panel later this year for the milestone 20th series of the BBC One dancing competition. Ahead of the series airing, the 61-year-old was part of an ITV program about the Savoy where she enjoyed a five-star lunch with former King of the Jungle, Christopher. As they tucked into Beef Wellington Shirley told Christopher. I would love to go on I Am a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here, a stunned Christopher, who won the seventh series of the ITV series where celebrities are stripped of their luxuries and made to take part in grueling Bushtucker trials, replied, you would. Oh my God, you are bound to be asked. However, Shirley explained why she would not be able to sign up for the series, telling him, I can't because Strictly Come Dancing is on at the same time, so it clashes. Christopher warned Shirley about how difficult the Australian show is and reminded her he had to eat a kangaroo's penis as part of a Bushtucker trial. An unfazed Shirley replied, testicles, penis, whatever, it's just meat. I've wanted to boil a few of them in my lifetime, I'll tell you that. Christopher burst into laughter at her remarks before they continued to enjoy their meal and move away from the subject. The Savoy returned for a second series on Wednesday and the episode which featured Shirley focused on the hotel reopening its doors in the wake of the coronavirus pandemic. In a fiercely competitive luxury hospitality market, the managing director decided it was time to refurbish the royal suite as well as a new Gordon Ramsay restaurant.